I didn't start with metal drumming. I never even heard of metal until one night. When I was about 13, I think. I left the radio on late one night and this band called Suffocation came on. And it was the scariest thing I'd ever heard. And I was so scared I had to turn the lights on in my room. It was like 11 o'clock at night. I never made a conscious decision to do, you know, property management or, you know, farm work or gardening or anything like that. With my energy levels that I used to have and still do, um, an inside job or an office job was just out of the question. You know, I'd be throwing my sandwich on the roof and seeing if it, you know, it would stick or not. <laughs> Where I mowed over the gnome. That's where he lives now. <laughs> Every night, after work, after dinner, cleaning the house, putting the kids to sleep, I'll go down and do 40 push-ups, do my endurance practice, which is like metronome work, and then now half an hour of playing the songs, and then I'll do weights afterwards, and more push-ups, and intense stretching, drink plenty of water, and by then it's time for dinner again. <laughs> At first I was like, yeah, it's just a job, but now I really enjoy what I do. I really like gardening. I like being able to go to a place and seeing it all messy, you know, the wind's blowing everything over, the grasses are growing, blah, blah, blah. And at the end of the day, you look back and you're like, wow, that looks really neat and tidy. If someone walked through here, they'd be like, this is a nice, happy place. After touring Europe and stuff in America with a few bands who do it for a living, I realised that they're all pretty jaded, unhealthy, and it's such an uh, unrealistic lifestyle. It's just not a lifestyle I, I want. To have a balanced, normal lifestyle is very important. Wow, well, that's pretty cool. I think that was probably better actually. You that yeah. Raising a kid's always exhausting, but I figured if I want to be the best I can be, I'll just have to be a little bit more exhausted every night. There's still time, in, if you really want to make it happen, to you know, have a musical career at the same time. So do it for the music, do it for the love, you get to see the world, you look on the positive side of it. And the only reason I do it is to play music.